It's chefing time at the Hilltop Senior Citizen Center. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, we cook a home meal, just like what mama would cook, meatloaf and briskets and things like this. Coble and a crew of about seven people are hard at work several days a week preparing meals for the community. And there's only one rule to get a serving. The qualification is to be hungry. That's it. We feed about 20 people in house and we deliver about 38 meals in the community. They deliver to seniors over 60 in a significant part of North Amarillo and downtown, and they'll be delivering Thanksgiving meals again this year, just like they have the past three decades. It'll be our 34th year, and so it'll be November the 19th, the Saturday before Thanksgiving. And uh, it starts at 11 o'clock, we're here to 3, 3.30, and one of the police uh, law enforcement fraternities, they do most of the serving. In fact, they're doing most of the donating of the food also. But cooking up hot meals for those in need is only part of the service at Hilltop. We do wellness checks also. Uh, from time to time, we'll, we've had three people who didn't respond, didn't answer the doors, but we know they were supposed to be there. But we come up with a little packet that we give them and they stick it to the refrigerator. And once the paramedics got inside, they had that little packet we gave them. They knew who to call. They knew who the medicines and all of that. And Coble says for him, he was raised in serving others. I always go back to mom and dad. I, I have to, mom and dad. Uh, we weren't rich by any means. We were poor people. But mom and dad had this unique gift of just loving people. But the main thing is just doing what God, the gift that he's given me. In Amarillo, Rochelle Hamilton Jr., KMR, Local 4 News.